Hello Terrarians, Trex here, welcome back to Terraria 1.3 with T-Rexy-W. This episode we are going to be trying to find some floating islands, so I'm going to gather up all my rope, vine rope maybe, no, just regular rope actually. I'm going to gather up all my rope and some dirt, gather up my meteor shot, we're just going to run through the world, gathering, or er, firing our mini shark into the air. To try and find some floating islands. I worked a bit more on the vault, uh, not too too much, but still uh, some substantial changes, and that will continue progressing throughout the next few episodes of the series. So I'm going to speed this up, but we'll just check for a few initially. Maybe there's one above the living tree. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, yeah, I, I I need to get to the umbrella faster. We can also try and water bolt. I don't know if that'll be long enough though. But anyways guys, I'm going to put on some awesome music for you guys to enjoy. And yeah, then we're going to start uh, shooting our gun to find some floating islands. So let's go. Well, actually guys, quick change of plans. We are not going to be using the mini shark to try and find some floating islands. We, we may do that later during the episode if... Um, we can't find any, but I think what I want to do is use a gravitation potion to try and find them. So let's just do that. We're going to buff up and... Oh, crazy. All right, so if we do hit the floating island, we are going to have to react fairly quickly. Oh, there we go. We already have found one. Awesome. So I'll tag that on the map. Oh, wait, it's not a floating island. It's a floating lake. That's really cool. Uh, with plenty of rain clouds and harpies. This is crazy. Man, it's been so long, I forgot how hard harpies can get. Uh, let's space gun them, because space guns are cool. Come on. I, I, I like how, I f uh, how it flips it. Oh, into it. We got an achievement. Into orbit. Um, I like how it flips the screen instead of flipping the character, although it can sort of be fairly trippy. Man, these harpies are difficult to kill. Uh, so that's going to be an issue. Harpies, but let's see what else we can find just by uncovering as much of the world as possible. Wow, we're already at the desert. Man, these gravitation potions are awesome. But so we found a floating lake. Let's see if we can find an island with an actual cabin on it. And hopefully there's no harpies chasing us. We don't have to worry about wyverns though, because this is not hard mode. That is a very, very good... Oh, there we go. I see one, I see one. Okay, dodge it. That's an actual floating island this time, with a cabin included. Boom. Alright, let's see what we got in the Skyward Chest. This is a nice island. Wow, look at all that ground we've already uncovered. That's crazy. Uh, we still have a minute left of this, but... Wild Lucky Horseshoe negates fall damage and all of the Umbrella's uses. So, there we go. We're going to equip that. We'll just take all the rest of this. Uh, grab the chest and we will come back later um, But since we got that the lucky horseshoe we don't we no longer need the umbrella Which is really good, which means I'll have a free accessory slot So you're just going to move this down here and unfavored it and I'll find something to replace it with later But we only have 54 seconds left of gravitation and I'll go figure out how to make a, another gravitation potion But for now, let's just use this up as much as possible uh, just until we can find another floating island, hopefully. That will be soon. Anyways, we are about midday. I think if we are content with what we find, we'll just work on the vault, maybe? Or something? Yeah, this is a much better strategy than the mini shark. Just getting a gravitation potion. Um, or we could try and find Hermes boots, because I really need some of those. But anyways, we are just going to keep up here because we are almost out of time let's just keep flying across as much as possible hey say so okay good 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 we found another floating island slash lake slash floating island lake so that's slightly unfortunate I don't know why there's floating island lakes in the game but um that's pretty good we found one floating island and we found two floating lakes so yeah, that's pretty cool. And we got into orbit. The achievement into orbit. Let's check that out. You can only go down from here. That's pretty cool. What? Oh gosh, we have a harpy on our tail. Um, let's just 
Let's see if we can kill a harpy and get some feathers, because I think we'll actually need feathers to make the uh, potions. I know we need them to make feather fall potions, but I don't know what we need to make to, uh, what we need to make gravitation potions. So if we can just make some gravitation potions with feathers or anything, I'll find out the materials needed, and it'll all be good. We'll be able to continue exploring the world. Um, let's see. Here, is the man recharged? Go on fire on target. Try and line up the shot to get both harpies. That'd be great. This is going well. Come on. He's one hit away. There we go. Boom. Headshotted the harpy. Oh man, this is crazy. I have not been to a floating island. I've not discovered a floating island in forever. So this is quite fun. We are almost dead though. We have 96 silver that I do not want to lose because that is some spoils from the floating island. Let's see here. Let's return back to base. Come on, get the shot off. Yo-yo. Forgot. I keep forgetting to use my yo-yo. Um, there we go. Let's. We're going to uh, jump off the edge of the floating island because we can. I should have grabbed some cloud blocks. I regret everything. Anyway, shouldn't take any fall damage. Boom, right at the pyramid. That is pretty sweet. We still need to get a magic mirror, and I should have brought a recall potion. Maybe next episode or something, we'll go on a quest for the magic mirror. And the Hermes boots at the same time. And some, some more gems so we can make a better... Oh, wait, no, we have the slime hook. Never mind, we don't need a better hook, because we already have the awesome slime hook. Uh, but yeah, we traveled quite far, actually. We are really far away. Um... We have a gold, so it's not worth dying for, but it is worth saving and exiting for. Ha ha ha! This is this is cheating. I shouldn't be doing this, but I feel no shame. Anyways, let's. We're back home. Awesome. Should have put the money away from the piggy bank. All right, let's check the wiki to find out what we need to make a gravitation potion. New Google logo, by the way. It's interesting. It's not my favorite. I kind of like the old one. Um. But that one's still pretty cool. I like how the G has changed font. We need bottle of water, fire blossom, death bleed, blink crew, and a feather, as I guessed. We can use a place bottle or an alchemy table. Let's see. Where can we get this alchemy table? Uh, found randomly in the dungeon. Dang it. So, bottle of water, fire blossom. I think I remember that. Sorry about the map. Bottle of water, fire blossom, death weed something else uh we'll talk about the vault later let's see here here's a bottle I'll get some water i should have a fire blossom fire blossom excellent uh death weed blink root and feather death weed blink root and feather we just have to water this up so let's go find the nearest body of water which is just over here and then we'll go find some more floating islands, I guess, until the end of the episode. Because this has only been ten minutes. Um, I should have found something else to put here. I don't know. Where's the body of water? I think I built a bridge over it. Uh, let's see here. We'll find something eventually for this. But for right now, I'm just going to keep the umbrella there so that I can float like so. And then eventually we will replace it, as I've said like three times now. And there's got to be some water closer to our house than this, but this is the route I chose, and it's the route I'll stick with. Man, I really need a magic mirror. When we get back to our house to craft it, oh, by the way, guys, uh, when we get back to our house to craft it, I'll get some recall potions. But, by the way, guys, I got a new pair of headphones. They are pretty sweet. They, I went to Best Buy. I need them for a uh, music production class I'm taking at school. Well, I needed uh, good headphones, not just earbuds for a music production class I'm taking at school. And I have some $20 Jeep Sony headphones that I've used for a while. It's my third pair. The previous two have broken, but I love them. So I'm going to start taking those to school. And I got myself this really nice pair of Sony headphones that goes completely over the ear. It doesn't just sit on top of the earlobe, which makes it extremely comfortable. Um... I got them for 30 bucks, refurbished off Amazon, and they're tw they were $150 at Best Buy, so I think I got a pretty sweet deal, and I am really enjoying them. They are very nice quality, 
Yeah, it's super nice and it blocks out noises and stuff. But anyways, we need to find our alchemy station. There we go, place bottle and gravitation potion. Aw uh, yeah, now let's grab some recall potions as well. Just so that it makes it a bit easier to get home. How many do we have? Yeah, we have 26. We'll grab 10 and we'll just we'll just keep them in our inventory right there. But anyways, man, I say in anyways too much. But anyways, <laughs> see what I did there? I I just said I said it anyways too much. Then I said it anyways. It's funny. <laughs> Please love me. Uh, let's equip the night owl potion. It's getting dark and gravitation potion. Here we go to the right side, trying to find more than just a floating lake. And we have the magic horseshoe equipped now, so we shouldn't receive damage by hitting a floating island. But this will be pretty cool. Oh, that sun looks gorgeous. Look at it, the pink sun. That's that's pretty gorgeous. I. I am a fan of that. We're going to use this map mode because it might be easier for finding floating islands. Possibly. We'll see. We'll see. Eventually, we'll come back through and clear up the rest of these, the sky and get these triangles out of the sky and stuff once we can fly. But for now, we're just going to have big, ugly black triangles in the way, and it's going to be slightly annoying, and it's going to be kind of irritating. Pretty soon, I need to provide a world download for you guys because this is a brand new Let's Play world. Uh, from a couple months ago and there's still no download so after we finish the vault I guess I'll create a new download for your enjoyment but you can just continue messing around with the 1.2 world for now I guess until I get my priorities straight and make the new world download but anyways no floating islands yet on this side hopes are kind of getting dashed unless we can find one it is nightfall that's here. We already did find one though, and we can probably get to it uh, sometime. Um, I need some harpies, cause I need some feathers. We'll get some dirt. We'll get. Oh dang! I meant to get a rope to that. Um, to that floating island. That would have been a good idea. One to tricks. Gosh dang it! I think we still have time. But there's a harpy. Let's battle it, so that we can create another. Potion, come on, kill the harpy. Kill the harpy. Where is he? Where is the harpy? There he is. Come on. Get him, get him, get him. Oh man. Uh fire randomly into the crowd. Get the harpies. We need to make more gravitation potions. Oh boy. Are we going to get a feather? Come on, come on, get a feather. Is that a feather? No, it's not. Keep firing at him. Oh boy, I'm wasting ammo when I have to turn around to do this. Space gun to the rescue. Okay. Come on, turn back around. And out of mana. There we go. That harpy's almost... Oh, come on. We were slain by the harpies. <sighs> okay. Okay, so, so we were killed by the harpies. That's fine. We did get to experience the full effect of our gravitation potion. And we do not have a feather... So, we are going to have to build a pillar of dirt blocks to our floating island. That is going to be fun, and it is right over the corruption. Wow. Great job. Um, I don't think there's a way that we can reach this. I'll have to get to that off camera. But anyways, guys, that is it for this episode of Terraria 1.3 TXW. We found some floating islands, made some progress on the vault, and got... Some, uh, some, something. Oh, yeah, we got the horseshoe and stuff. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching this episode of Terraria 1.3 with GXW. If you like the video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. Next episode of Terraria will be Sunday with Terraria Living Underground on Friday. And tomorrow will be an episode of Prison Architect or Beam and G-Drive. I don't know which. I will see you all next time, and goodbye.